tarmacking over their front gardens, sort of, and ripping sort of, them out, ripping it out completely, uh, sort of re to avoid paying the residents' parking zone. Yeah, and then um, I think a lot of people were really silenced by it. Like it was like, oh well, that's happened now. That happens with everything. You know, people they get told by the authority that that's it, and then that they think that that's it. You know, uh, yeah, but there's still a bit of resistance going on in central Bristol. You know, the best resistance. They keep fucking burning the buggers. Yeah, yeah. And you know the figures on what's been damaged is fucking way above what they're claiming. Yeah. Well, it was propaganda as well, wasn't it? It was, it was saying it was a 20, 20, I think 19 machines damaged. Looking up more than that. But again, that's another thing, you know what I mean? The, a company has made a big fucking lot of money from that, yeah, putting all those machines in, you know? Yeah, and all the lines, yeah. all the lines, all the line companies and stuff like that. Um, Your friend at George's, no doubt. And then NCP car parks, they've coined in now because everyone's parking in there now. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So the traffic's still coming in. They're talking about trying to reduce congestion in the city centre. All it's done is just. Yeah. 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 You come down your area for fucking half past seven in the morning, we wouldn't be going like this. Mm. We'd be fucking back there somewhere. Yeah. It's all this is done is take away a lane of traffic. And cause further congestion. Mm. It's cheap, nothing. That fucking bus lane. Yeah. So that could be like a two-person lane or something like that, can it? So we could go in there and. Yeah. But what's the, what bus is this then? Parking right, eh, mate. Uh, uh, only that. Yeah. Mm. It's another white elephant, and again, they were meant to be going to put a station onto the parking right. Yeah. That's stopping a lot of the buses ever come up. People get on the train into Bristol, mm -hmm. drifted down, and said, Well, neat. Yeah. They reckon it's going to be 2017 18 before it's even looked at it again. Mm. Yeah, what a little fucking rubbish. So, what's the future for Avon Mafford, Steve? If we don't. If, if people don't do something soon, it's very fucking bleak, I'm afraid. Yeah. It's very fucking bleak. You know, it's all going to come, you know, unless people really didn't support Aiden Mountain and say, no, you can't. Yeah. You can't allow part of Bristol to be turned into a dumping ground. The weird thing that's gone on, let's just go back to the residents' parking zone, it kind of links into that, but it's basically made people fight against each other. This is my space, yeah. where it used to be communal. For me, when they put all the lines everywhere, it was suddenly the council saying, no, this is our road, these are our roads, yeah, and we're, we're going to make money from it. Oh, yeah. And so, so everyone fights against each other for the same spaces, you know? It's all leading towards Agenda 21, isn't it? Mm. Total domination of the fucking poor and before you know it, you've got to draw your money out your bank if you're an only boy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's Agenda fucking 21, it's the Rothschild Agenda. Mm. Bankers versus the people. Mm. I mean, we thought we were going to catch George so it was a Ventures meeting the other week. Yeah. I had a friend go up with a camera I'm fucking desperately trying to get him at a Venturers meeting because mm. if you can catch him at a Venturers meeting and you get it on tape, it's yeah. finished Yeah, because he basically said he handed in his resignation He claims to have uh, broken all ties Yeah, but that, we know that's not... It's bollocks Yeah, we're still in the same club Fuck, he had a secret meeting with those two that owned the fucking port in December yeah. yeah Two years ago Yeah No minutes, nothing Yeah That's when they struck the fucking deal and the price yeah, do you know about that Bristol 2015 um, company as well? Because I've been reading about that. I think uh, ex-councillor Christian Martin wrote something about it the other day. Yeah, he set it up. It was it's all public money. The green Cup, all money came Ferguson in. Ferguson set, set, set it up. Yeah, and then it was set up as a limited company. Yeah. That we think the money's there, a lot of the money's then channeled through to his fucking sole trader business out of tobacco. Mm. Which is Clondale or Clondee or something fucking... Oh, Clondale prom Promenade or whatever it is, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I've seen that. And that's how he filters the money. Boyce had done a load of stuff on it. Yeah. And a lot of that money that was going to the Green Capital, well, there wasn't a lot of money that went in outside of the public money, mm -hmm. because what they were doing, first bus and all that, were, <coughs> were giving like for like. Mm. They weren't actually donated. Mm. Um, but they will take the money out. They got a fleet of cars, didn't they, on leases from, uh, was it Wessex? Hmm. I mean, this is the other thing that happened in the summer, was this, this is the main, um, yeah. 
Artery Road, isn't it, for all the emergency services? He shot a fucking, he shot us off, he don't give a fuck. Yeah. There's some kids out on a fucking traffic island. Yeah. Be fucking wild. Yeah. Um, well, I, I, I came down here for two of them, not all of them, but two of them, to see what was going on, and that it was largely a PR stunt. I saw that they had a well, photo shoot here, just here, and they had all people, like, they said, right, everyone start cycling now. Yeah. They had, like, 100 people cycling together yeah. to get them all in the shot so it looked like it was busy. But also, that was another reason that was done. Yeah. Uh, even wildlife, just one piece of land. Oh, I've there. seen that, yeah, yeah, yeah. And that was another reason they thought they were going to get loads of people coming in. They bought a piece of fucking land, really, and it's not rip a car up. Yeah. Because no one is coming in. Yeah. They've done all this work. No one's it's a piece of fucking land, that's all it is. Yeah. It's not like there are other places. Mm. Out in Royal Hill and all that. It's right. a piece of fucking land. Mm -hmm. You can only walk down it and back up it. Yeah. Because you can't go on the railway land. Yeah. But that was another reason why he wanted to shut that up and you get people to go down and support the piece of land that wouldn't they Uh-huh. Oh, that's interesting, that isn't it? There's, there's, no, there's never anyone there, Paul. Yeah. They built this big fucking hut and everything. I saw that. Yeah, I've been in that. There's never anyone there. Yeah. They really burned their fucking fingers. Yeah. Yeah, the guys that knew were going to turn it into something they would have made money, mm. which was the surfing people. They're now going to Easter Compton. Yeah. Were rejected. Is that the? The, what's it called? Um, the uh, the wave thing that they can make the waves for surfing. Right, the reef, the reef or whatever. Yeah. Um, yeah. Well, they wanted it, mm. so that would have brought money in. Yeah. But they were rejected, and they're now gone to East of Compton. Mm. And the wildlife bought a piece of land, and that's all it is—a piece of fucking land. Mm. The budget with birds not on it. Mm. You know, there ain't no deer or anything like that. You ain't gonna come across any fucking deer because there ain't no woods. Mm. And by the time the trees that they plant are, are any size, mm. I'm going to be fucking long time a fossil at the ground. Yeah, well that was another thing that happened when we had um, the Stapleton allotment um, protests going well, on. Well yeah, I mean, they that were up the trees. Yeah. Now when that happened, uh, two weeks, uh, sorry, the week after that, it, this is kind of coincidentally, Ferguson and... Uh, so I do with what, like the, the, Yeah, but basically, oh yeah, of course they were up there as well, they? were they? were like, Bristol. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, but basically, Ferguson come to um, Eastfield Park and was doing the millionth tree oh, planting, right? Yeah, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. And we all we all went up there, Stoughton allotment and feed Bristol and stuff, and went there and things. And um, you know, it's it's kind of well, it's ironic really, isn't it, to be planting trees whilst you're ripping down well, mature ones. They gave, yeah. they, they gave the bailiffs access to the land, didn't they? Yeah, well, like, I was there when they did, mate. Yeah, well, they let them through. Yeah. I've seen it happen. There's some video as well. Yeah, that was it. Once they done that, yeah. it, it was done. You know, done deal. Done deal. Yeah. That, and these people were claimed to be wrong. Well, that's big yeah, money like, as well with a metro bus, you know, because that's going to link up to the airport and things and everything else. Well, so you know, they've all paid as well. And I don't think it's going to work. No. Well, the our metro bus. How come? Well, they, already they're talking. They can't meet the fucking schedule of buses. They originally said one every twenty minutes. Yeah. Trust yeah. me, it's another way. That's, that's one of Ferguson's. Um, well, it's ain't no more. Oh, it's not no more. It's still it's it's sold it. Bristol think. Beer Factory um, thing on there. Yeah, they might be buying beer off of it, but yeah. I thought I'd already sold it, but he wanted eight hundred thousand for it. Yeah, the man's a comedian. Mm. <laughs> yeah.